favelas in your way Merciful, compassionate There is none like you This is Anthony Odiambo, the CEO of Global Missionary Link Inc., a non-profit organization that is based in Maryland but works globally. I remember in the last video I shared about how I managed to uh, go to college after high school, after being in a way that it could not be able for me to pay my school fees, but I had to be strategic, focus, and uh, come up with uh, the work plan that could enable me to pay my school fees and I remember I shared about how I entered into construction work and uh, I worked in construction and saved some cash that enabled me to go to school and how I also raised a cow that enabled me to sell and uh, continue paying my school fees and how I uh, managed to convince the college to give me work scholarship and also the scholarship from the chapel. And uh, I remember I had uh, completed on um, the, uh, the last aspect that uh, I wanted to share, but uh, I think the video ended up, it was about fundraising. So today I want to continue to uh, share about fundraising part. Uh, first of all, as a community son, uh, born in, a, in the village, in one of the remote village, I had to make sure that I'm disciplined and um, I respect everybody. I talk to them very well so that they see the importance of me and uh, the importance of them when they are either one day I want them to help me, they will be convinced in, inside themselves and enable them to pay for my school fees. So I remember I organized for fundraising and because I was a disciplined student, a uh, 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 son of the village, uh, all the villages and uh, all the friends to my dad, the friends to my mommy, they are uh, uh, contributed for uh, the fundraising, the fund drive that I had organized for me to complete my uh, uh, degree. And I remember even when I joined a uh, postgraduate diploma in education, uh, the same people uh, added the energy in contributing for me to go to school. So what do I want to teach the young people? I want to teach the young people that it is better for us to be disciplined and for us to respect any person in our community. So when you respect the people in the community, you give them a sense of attraction that when they help you, you'll be in a position even to help or motivate or inspire other young people. So what do I want to say this? You know, life does reward those who fully accept it on its own terms. With this attitude, you don't waste time grumbling about the hand you have been dealt. Rather, you look at the card and make the best possible play. It is make a lemonade with a lemon, accept of life, and is guaranteed to propel you to the realization of your highest uh, value. So, once you accept yourself, and uh, accept your situation that your parents have no money and um, they uh, they cannot be able to support you to proceed your, with your college education. You don't need to give up. Yeah, because many young people, they give up after their parents have struggled to ensure that they have gone up to their high school and uh, they have completed the Form 4 level, then they attempt to give up and uh, they they ended into the lifetime of uh, maybe drinking alcohol messing up their themselves uh, yeah but that is not the life that's why i could i said that the life it's you the way you make it is way 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 it will be so uh i'll continue to tell us that uh it's better for you to sit down uh have a meeting within yourself uh, come to the self-realization of yourself and uh, be strategic. Uh, do uh, 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 Come up with a goal that you need to achieve. And uh, as a summary of what I was discussing, uh, come up with a strategic, uh, work a strategic plan. 
like if it is for four years, it's for three years, it's for two years, come up with a strategic plan and say from this time to this time, I want to work out even if I'm, I'm going to do uh, the, uh, the maid work, I'm going to do a uh, construction, I'm going to cultivate uh, vegetables and do other shoddy job. But at the end of the day, the money that you get, you make sure that you invest in the asset. And when you invest in the asset, uh, the asset that uh, has that will appreciate in its value as time goes by so that when you sell, you will continue to achieve what you want to achieve. Like I, I gave an example, like for me, I, I need to be an entrepreneur. So I'm working towards being an entrepreneur. So uh, others, maybe they need to be a doctor, they need to go to be in a professional world, but it is you to make the life that you want to live in. So uh, my encouragement to young people, first of all, let us seek God, ask God for the wisdom and uh, come up with a strategic plan about your life, come with achievable goal and then work towards it. Uh, try all through to save, uh, 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 deal only with uh, the assets in your life. Try to avoid some liability, things that will take away money from you. And then uh, you have to be ambitious and you'll make it. Thank you very much. Uh, God bless you.